as you are determined to follow, you are resolute. There may be trials, there may be temptation. You are praying that it seems the answers are not coming. And the devil is whispering to you, why don't you go to that place? Go and collect power from that sister, from that baba. Oh, a, 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 a prophet just landed. My friends shared the story with me. My God. They were all in the program in their church in South Africa. He told the senior business, don't let us invite this person. And the person said, why not? He says, this is of God, is a man of God. I've had about it, a prophet. Prophet. He said, okay. He was the one who picked the guy from the airport. As soon as they came, as God we had it, the briefcase that the man carried, suddenly the thing opened, and they saw God. Rat. You see? With red something on it. And as soon as they did flip over, the guy called it with the blood. He said, who to carry it? <laughs> that was the first signal. So the program started, they were, ah, uh, people fell. Power everywhere. At the end of the side, the man said, show me what to show me. This is what happened today. They took the man, my friend said, Let, let's wait till you. <laughs> Day two, power. Day three. By the time they were landing on the program, you will not be deceived in Jesus' name. Some people have come to this ministry simply because Pastor Lambert is stopping what they are doing. No, 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 I don't think there is. In fact, somebody said, people say there is no power in this church. Uh, he said there is no fire. I said, go to where the fire will be roasting. <laughs> <laughs> By the last day, mm, the man who has been demonstrating everywhere. He said, now bring all the offering that we have collected. He said, up and hit, really by the band, it's all offering. He said, one more offering. I will cost you that you better bring all this. He said, what? what? He said, I don't know what to do. <laughs> A lot of people are not going to call themselves. So they must work out something. In order for things to go the way they expected, to cut the long story, they had to invite South African police. <laughs> I pray for you, you will not be deceived. Oh, yeah. You will not be eroded from the path of light in the name of God. On the last day of the program, something happened. And the man, my friend said, God said, don't let us do this. He said, no, the man is under the Spirit of God. They did it. They closed, the church closed permanently. Today in South Africa, they don't have address again. Because the man came with satanic power and he closed the church. You can't walk with Jesus Christ and you will not see the glory of God. I encourage you, stay tuned. Don't be deceived. God may be slow. He will be steady, mm -hmm. but it is too sure that you will arrive at your destination. Mm -hmm. Don't follow those who are telling you, see, we made it to hurry, 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 hurry up, brothers. No, it doesn't lead to anywhere, it only leads to destruction. As you stay to follow Jesus Christ, I'm too sure of something that is going to happen to you. Yeah. God will make you what He talks about in the name of Jesus. It's what the Word of God. He says, "My word that has gone out of my mouth shall not return unto me void." So if God says, "I will make you," stay tuned. There are some of you you have been you have been, you have been passing through certain pressure. Simply because you're on the right track, and some people are telling you, "Well, why don't you come to our side?" All this prayer, 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 that you so what has it resulted? If there are some people in this minute this morning, I mean this evening, 
I say to my father, the Lord will shut the mouth of all your accounts in Jesus. Before the end of this month, you will have a tangible testimony.